we're after are professional runners. We find them, we take them as a team, and we bring them back. And above all else, we don't ever, ever let them get in the cars. Home sweet home. You know, reviewing movie sequels is somewhat hard, especially if it's the fifth one in. At this point, the movie has developed followers and fans and may not appeal to the average moviegoer, but it's this fan base is enough to keep the sequels coming. I'm talking specifically about Fast Five, sequel number five of the Fast and the Furious movies. Unfortunately, it just no longer attracts too many new fans. Of course, these movies have developed a large enough following that they don't really need new fans. I have seen parts of one or two of the other Fast and the Furious movies while channel surfing, and I take the non-follower stance when watching and reviewing. And you know what? For a non-follower, I enjoyed myself. Yes, it is over the top, ridiculous, and corny, and could never in a million years be anywhere near realistic, but this is a feel-good movie with a pretty good cast. They are funny and easier to relate to, and I found myself caught up in the storyline more than once. In addition to the usual Vin Diesel, Paul Walker, and Jordana Brewster, other actors such as Tyrese Gibson, Ludacris, and surprise, Dwayne The Rock Johnson, yes, Dwayne The Rock Johnson, grace the screen. They did a good job for the corny script and they are, they are given to work with and added enough humor to make this movie entertaining. As always, there is plenty of action. And at one point, Vin Diesel and The Rock duke it out using just their manpower in the ultimate hugest dudes ever battle. The only person missing was Arnold. For not having seen the other movies completely, I wasn't lost and could figure out what was going on when it came to past events I missed. But I evidently missed out on who certain characters were because my fellow viewers were cheering at times that I thought were not cheerworthy. Other than not catching little inside jokes and recurring characters that come with sequels, however, I did not feel left out at all. I was supposed to get Ray's handprint. This movie was pretty good and I enjoyed myself. Was it worth the price of admission? I would say if you love the Fast and the Furious movies, then most definitely, especially since you've probably been waiting for this to come out anyway. And if you're not an addict, however, wait until it comes out in DVD for a fun, feel good, easy to watch movie. It was, it was fast. <laughs> furious. Funny. Ridiculous. Hilarious. Over the top. Dwayne The Rock Johnson. <laughs> <laughs> Luda! Luda, Chris! Yeah. Oh my god. There was so much going on in that movie, I didn't know what to do. Like, when they drag... Oh, I don't know if I'm allowed to spoil things. But, um... Oh, but there is a pretty <laughs> awesome... Spoil. When they Car are trip. driving... It's two cars. Vault. And they're, they're, they attach themselves to a vault, and they just drive through the city, and they rip the vault out of a police station. And these two cables are, like, slicing people and things and, and train stations and hats. Right. And they're just, like, they're just, like, swerving everywhere. And they had cheesy, the cheesiest dialogue I've ever heard in my entire life. What was it? I was born ready. Yeah, <laughs> like so, stuff like so that monotone. every time. I'm telling you, you have to see it. I don't right. care. I don't even think it's you should wait till DVD. Like I honestly think if you are you just want to have a good time. Like this is a movie where if you've had a bad day, go see it. It's so funny. We were enjoying ourselves quite a bit yeah. throughout the movie. Quite so. Uh -huh. And it, it's just you know what this movie is? It's just loving characters. <laughs> It's just enjoying. Yeah, that these is characters. what makes these movies are the cast and how they've been able to keep all the original cast and then bring in people like The Rock and Ludacris and you know whoever else to get in there because yeah, and every one of them had their own unique traits that were just perfect for this movie. Like, we need to assemble the team, and then what is there? Oh, yeah. There's a montage where mm -hmm. they assemble the team, because you need that. You need that in this kind of a movie. And then they have that badass biker chick who, yeah, oh, yeah. just brought it all. And she's like, I can get his handprint. <laughs> Takes the thing off, and she's in this bikini, and she Little just walks, skippies. and she just struts. And then they're just like, oh, yeah, did he slap that ass, or did he grab it? <laughs> yeah, Luda. It's so funny. Ludacris, Ludacris is the man. Oh, if he's you ever great. get he's great. He, makes a huge portion of this movie and he and did the, the opening title sequence mm -hmm. i believe yeah and the yeah, yeah. uh most of the soundtrack probably pretty sure probably <laughs> but it was just it was it was a lot of fun oh oh and after the credits oh there's, there's this 
Yeah, there's a surprise at the end of the credits. And especially if you've been watching the movies, if it's like, you know, you love the Fast and the Furious movies, yeah. definitely stay. But if you kind of know what's going on, or even if you don't know what's going on, you'll gather what's going on. Well, it's exactly like what you said. Both mm -hmm. of us are non, we're not, non we've seen bits and pieces of Fast and the Furious, but, but we were, I mean, even though we were forced to watch this movie, I kind of walked in going, oh boy, this is going to yeah. be a lot of crap. I was like ripping on it all day. I loved like, it. oh, guess what I have to watch tonight. And all of the people in the, it's Vin Diesel and The Rock are like our generation's Rocky Balboa and, you know. <laughs> Yeah. Sylvester Stone and, and Arnold Schwarzenegger. Arnold Schwarzenegger. So this was, it was good. It was worth the price of admission. It's like most definitely if you're a follower, um, if you don't feel like wasting money on another typical action flick, then you probably don't. But, but I mean, it was cool, so watch it. Um, and it's coming out soon, so make sure you see it. Um, make sure you see it fast and furiously. <laughs> fast. Maybe Quickly. Get over there. Quickly.